What drives you uh, to do what you do, to put yourself in the arena, to put yourself in the spotlight, if you will, time and time again? And not always under pleasant circumstances. No, I'm usually not under pleasant circumstances at all. I mean, I say my business is discrimination. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I, I call myself sometimes a traveling fairness salesman across the state um, because, you know, it's, it is sort of my job to be the ambassador mm -hmm. against discrimination, um, particularly when it involves the lesbian, gay, bisexual, or transgender community. But certainly, we are fierce anti-racist at the Fairness Campaign, um, mm -hmm. as well as we battle sexism and classism and every other ism because we feel that, you know, there's an inherent interconnectedness amongst all forms of oppression. That okay. Racism is classism, is sexism, is homophobia. And as long as, as one form of oppression persists in America, no form of oppression is ever going to desist. Okay. And so we have to take that holistic approach. And, and really, that's what drives me forward and, and motivates me and moves me on mm -hmm. in this work. Because it, it's not easy. It is oppressive because it deals with oppression. Um, but knowing that, that true equity is is potentially achievable and is certainly not the state in which we live right now and certainly okay. not in our state is is what compels me to to keep on keeping on mm -hmm.